The summer in the city is going to be hot and intriguing. The new manager and the chairman determined to add to the talent he's already funded. It was a sun-drenched start to the season with no sign of what lay ahead. Newcastle were highly fancied. Keegan's Cavaliers always play in front of full houses. The sight of £15 million Alan Shearer. And a debut for Gary Speed, Everton's new signing. What transpired was sheer torture for the travelling Toon Army. Parkinson. Unsworth. Pumps the ball towards Ferguson. A slip from Watson. A dive from Ferguson. He's given a penalty! Duncan Ferguson has been a handful. Watson's mistake led him through and a combination of the goalkeeper and Watson forced Ferguson to the floor and the referee, very well placed, says on the spot. Unsworth, the man who's never missed. Left foot, and Everton a stealing Newcastle's thunder. A confidently taken penalty, tucked in by David Unsworth, who spent almost 30 minutes marking Alan Shearer. He breaks free from him to give Everton the lead. Ferguson's head down, here's Speed! And Gary Speed, the lifelong Evertonian, scores for his team. That was supposed to be the script for Alan Shearer. Ferguson again winning the ball in the air with ease. Terrible marking from Newcastle and scintillating finishing from Speed. Time running out in the first half for Newcastle. Ginola. Shira! Tremendous save! Well, he picked his spot, but he's up against one of the best in the business. Shira in game one for Newcastle, thwarted by Southall in game 700 for Everton. Kevin Keegan isn't one to uh, throw teacups around the changing room. He's going to have some strong words in a second. This could be a third. His words could get stronger. Kanchelskis, excellent save by Hislop. Kanchelskis keeps going. Mayhem. Barrett's cross. Ferguson can't get there. And Newcastle are living dangerously. Almost scoring a third right on the brink of half-time. It took top-class goalkeeping from Hislop on two occasions there to stop him. It's Hinchcliffe, it's a curler. Oh. His lob would not have got that had it been a few inches nearer the goal. Didn't see many good free kicks in Euro 96. That was beautiful. Speed. Ferguson with a header! Oh, inches wide! He's hot. He's red hot. Speed. Excellent skills. Luck for Ferguson. Again, he beat two Newcastle defenders to the ball and almost beat the goalkeeper as well. to the sole attacking figure of Ferguson. Pushes and shoves and fights. Howie and... Well, almost got the goal he deserved. 
The referee stops the watch with a minute and a half to go. Shearer directly at goal. It's Shearer stopped by Southall, and that's the story of the afternoon. Things happen so quick. I, on the day, I didn't really think about scoring. I just wanted to get a result, and it was just nice that I, you know I got on the score sheet. Well, what will you remember of that day? What will you remember of your debut? I mean, it was all about Shearer, wasn't it? It was supposed to be a big day in history yeah, and everything. Yeah, I don't really remember. Say so these things go so quick, you don't really remember a lot of it. I just remember uh, how well we played, and especially in the first half. And I just remember the big dunks performance. He was, you know, he was sensational that day. And everybody really, it's just everyone played well and there's no, there no way we were going to get beat and that was the most pleasing thing. Duncan Ferguson was just awesome against Newcastle.